Wow, what an intro! Hello everyone and welcome to The Witcher 2 Assassins of Kings Enhanced Edition. I picked this game up on Steam last week and because The Witcher 3 is coming out next week and I like to play that if I can, I'm going to play Witcher 2. Uh, I also wanted to try Witcher 1 but Witcher 1 is I think too old and Witcher 2 has newer graphics, new game, all new, new storyline, maybe a continuation of the old one, I'm not sure. I did not do a lot of research on this game but let's just step into the game and see what the game is all about. Indeed, not it more repulsive than those monsters Look that defy the nature and to and are known by the name of witchers, as they are offspring of foul sorcery and witchcraft, unscrupulous scoundrels without consciousness and virtue. They are virtual creatures from hell, capable of only taking lives. Six years have passed since the memorable bay memorable day when the northern kingdoms had their forces united defeated the host of Nymphgard, the open battle of Brenna. Famine and disease reigned all in the north, elves and dwarves inhabited the ghettos. In ever increasing numbers they flee to the forest to join uh, Skoital's units? In Temeria, an unidentified assassin attempted to murder King Foltest. The king died at the hands of Geralt of Rivia, a professional monster slayer. And the main ch character of this game, a month passed. On the banks of the Poltar River, Foltest's army is victorious once more, ending civil strife in a country, yet the pride of his triumphs proves immense. Temeria, in the year 1271. was a dream, just a dream. Dungeon of Lavalette's castle, three days after the battle. Come on, Sixes, Daddy needs you. Oh, shit. Ha! Twenty orange to granddad. <laughs> Looky there, he's awake. You daft! Don't go in there! Shut it, he's in chains, can't do a thing. Am I right, Master Geralt? And it's sleepy time again. Roll again! Why? The dice didn't roll! Calling me a cheat? Take it back. Look, he's awake again. Monster slayer, my ass. A regular horson. I heard witches all start out as roadside orphans, taken in by mages. Mages who experiment on them. <laughs> Folks say they plow witches come the equinox. That's how they get those spooky eyes. Yeah, yeah, yeah interesting. Take him down and put him in the interrogation room. I thought you died. I'm not so easy to kill. Well, uh, looks like I've been. Uh... Whiplashed by a whip, and I had a lot of battle scars, but these I already had. Oh, I played a bit of the old first game, and I saw a lot of those scars already. So, I don't believe we've been introduced. To shoulder, looks like. Burn and Roach. 
Walk around behind me if you want to shake. Well, food show. Vess! Unshackle him. Geralt of Rivia. Care to introduce us? No, thanks. Bring something to drink. We can't sit here cotton mouth. You will tell me everything you remember. The entire assault. And all that happened in the solar. And if I refuse? I shall have to beat you. I've commanded the special forces for a while. Got good at beating others. You're a witcher. You'd endure much. You better believe it. Worst case scenario, you'll suffer through it, go back to your cell, and tomorrow, they'll publicly gut you, skin you, and mm, hang you. Nice. Just like that? For nothing? No, for Temeria. Downright praiseworthy. Where should I start? It was a long day. I wish to hear the important bits. Well, let's start at the top then. Um, this morning the king summoned me, I guess. Just so we're clear on this, I was not eager to go into battle. But Foltest is not someone you refuse. Okay, one thing about this game, this game has mature content in it, uh, for example nudity, which will be in the scene next up ahead. I will cut these pieces out because of YouTube, uh, because I don't want any problems. I hope you can accept it. Which you? His Majesty, King of Tiberia, Pontar, Mahakam, and Sodden, blah, blah, Senior blah, Protector blah. of Bruges, summons Master Geralt to appear before him. Tell him I'll be there shortly. Sorry to intrude like this, milady, but the King... We heard you. A pleasant day to you, milady. <laughs> Witcher. He just wants to watch. Stupid war. Could have been such a beautiful morning. A war can never be stupid when waged by your king. A wise war is a contradiction, Triss. Then maybe you know just how I should advise our lustful monarch. Stop falling in love, sire no further bastards, and don't wage stupid wars. Genius. You know these bastards could vie for the throne in the future? Then we'd have an even more senseless conflict. Which doesn't change the fact that... I know. Altest and the other northern monarchs are neither the smartest nor the most refined. But they're kings, one of whom we serve. And I'll see Foltest is summoned, protect him if need be. But once the castle falls, we leave. Did you dream of the Wild Hunt again? Mm-hmm. Hmm. Let's talk about the dream. I get the feeling that dream's important. Running frantically through the forest. The wild hunt. They're the last things I remember. I wake up and try to relive the dream and the memory, hoping I'll find some guidance. Some clue to grab onto. Something that'll help me recover my memory. Dreams can be very powerful. Some people claim they can <clears throat> even shape reality. People claim a lot of things. The problem is, it's often nonsense. We'll know in time. I'm sure of it. Um, what about the assassin? The unlucky assassin? How did the autopsy go? It was a nightmare. In the months since you killed him, the king's medics poked around in his corpse like a bunch of amateurs. What arrived in that cart? Well, I wouldn't even call it a corpse. Desperation. Foltest has some trust issues. Did you learn anything? His pupil suggested he could probably see in the dark as well as you. I couldn't put an age on him. The killer snuck past all the guards and nearly killed Foltest and me a month ago. And now you tell me he was a witcher? Possibly. I'm just saying what the autopsy showed. 
I haven't told anyone, nor do I plan to. I know what it could do to you if it got out. You might be a savior, a king's witcher now, but masters can be as fickle as the cults they ride. One of the scouts swears he saw a dragon down by the river. Claims he ran into a Skoyatogi. Skoyotail, okay. That would have been the way if the dragon hadn't this swooped word. down. The elves apparently bowed in prayer and he escaped. A dragon? In the midst of civilization? Oh, please. Besides, does it matter? Witchers don't hunt dragons. Or has something changed? Nothing's changed. And you're right. It's probably not a dragon. Although it could be a fork tail or a slizzard. Maybe even an overgrown wyvern. The scout ran into some elves and scurried away. That's how that story begins and ends. Well, I guess then it's time to go. All right. Time to look to the lustful king and his stupid war. I'll join you later. Yeah, it really is a stupid war. Play a little through it and you'll see when we get there. So, welcome. Welcome, welcome to battle. There are some trebuchets on our left and a lot of camps to our right. You see all those? Well, that's not all. There are a lot more. Uh, let's see. There is one way to sense. There we go. Ingredients, etc. True to a small meditation circle or thingy. And that brings us a lot of resources like these, which we can craft into potions. Uh, really powerful potions, actually. Eventually, I guess. Um, but we need to get other ingredients, so I will just pick them up. I won't go everywhere to just pick everything up, but things I'll uh, find along the way, I will get. Oh, hello. Good to see you. Morning, Witcher. Those blades of yours should be useful today. Um... Full tests would be assassin. You said you'd ask around. I put the word out. I did. And? It's a riddle wrapped inside a secret. I thought you knew people who could help. I can give you any cutthroat in Temeria. Temeria? Problem is, your assassin came from elsewhere. You sure? Sure as you stand before me. Hmm. Well, that's not a very good thing. Does full test have to continue the siege? No. We're to mount an assault. Truth be told, I'd rather sit here than risk my neck on those walls. Job done? I did what oh. you asked. You killed the cockatrice. Wonderful. Tough job. Routine witcher's work. I'll have your coin as soon as we finish off the lavalettes. I'll be generous, I promise. I'd like it beforehand. Promises made before battle are often hard to keep. I guess we don't get it at the moment. But let's take care and let's just go. Um, I know that this was here uh, and these herbs here and there are some more people here we can talk to this is a real RPG so yeah these things are uh, part of the game we know each other don't recognize your old mates we're the Crinfrid Reavers I lost my memory as did Boholt after the hunt for the golden dragon he took a spill and hit his head on a rock he can still be a beast in battle, but besides that, he don't do much save eating shit. Rarely even lusts after women. I doubt that's amnesia. <laughs> I'm Kenneth, and this one here they call Kenneth. And this is newborn. He's um, apprenticing with us, like. I haven't had much luck with the monsters of late, so we enlisted. Now new boy's gotten itself into this wager situation. Would you help us for old time's sake? I mean, we all got a little riled. But those are bygones, as I see it. We'd have set you free. The sorcerers, too. Boholt was just fooling about the raping and all. Uh, do I want to know it? Nah, no, that's just the, the story of the way. What the kind of way trouble are you in now? It's a matter of life, death, and quite a bit of coin in point of fact. New boy better night that he'll survive the assault in his shirt and knickers alone. We drunk a bit by then, I admit. But a wager's a wager. Our <laughs> honor's at stake. A soldier's honor versus a knight's. I think I get it. The very core of the matter, which we're slated to go in the first wave. So the going's fine, but we hard. New boy's brave, but he can't survive by courage alone. In any case, we've come into this bauble that's supposed to protect him, magically like. 
You aren't casting an expert's glance at it. Seeing a sorcery and such is not strange to you. Let me see this, Barbo. Your wolf medallion, I saw it shake. It reacts to magic. So it's true, what the priest said. Hear that, new boy? You'll be safe. We'll fleece that night, we will. Um, Where did you get the animal? Where did you get this talisman? We came by it, let's say. We were on patrol, see, and ran into a couple of novice priestesses praying at this shrine. They were nice, smiling and all. We don't want to take them two on patrol. <laughs> <laughs> You're a woman. Shut it! Boalt had one of his rare moments of clairvoyance, went rummaging in the shrine and found the amulet. Who knows what goes on in that head of his, but every now and then he wakes up as good old Boalt. Aye, we still cut some down with a single wallop. In any case, we took the amulet and went off to find the rest of the patrol. Oh, the wonders we saw. First, ran into some squirrels, vicious ones. Arrows flying everywhere, but we came through untouched. Barely three of the others still standing when a dragon swooped down. The elves fell to their knees. We all legged it. The amulet's magic for certain. Though it failed to protect the shrine from your patrolling. Aye, true. Well, now we don't know <laughs> what to think. Ooh, if you submit it, or what kind, I don't know. I said it an amulet could help. Seems to be the amulet brings trouble. Uh, the, yeah, it could be. I mean, the dragon is not an easy thing to catch. Let's say that. Who knows? Maybe the amulet is unlucky. Maybe it draws trouble. I doubt you left the shrine untouched. Then the square tail, the dragon. I told you as much. We need to get the boy some plate. Wait a minute. We owe the witcher <laughs> some thanks. But we're broke as shit peddlers. Fancy the amulet, witcher. It might draw trouble, be cursed in some way. But you might lift the curse. Sell it off. Ah, well, why not? I'll take it. It's all yours. Witcher, you available for normal business still? Willing to hunt monsters? Yeah, I'm willing. Why do you ask? Well, cause we were out with those scouts that saw the dragon. No one uh -oh. believes us, but the sound in the assembly, that's us. We'll find you after the battle, with you. Wait. <laughs> well, I guess we're going on dragon hunt when uh, things are over here. Let's see, are there uh, some more spices here today? But Yep, there they are. I know I can bring a brew a healing potion if I find all the stuff here, so... Let me just see. It was here. Nope. Oh, timber. That's a resource I haven't found yet. Um, I don't know what to do with all these crafting materials. Um, I haven't played this game that much. But we'll see. I know there are some more spices here. Oh, more herbs. Wolf's Bay. Some here. Nope. Oh, Iron Ore. Oil and iron ore. Okay. I guess I can make my own swords. Uh, there are some more spices here. Which one is this? These are basil and mandrake roots. And are there some more? Yeah, I see one there. Uh, Calendine? Trebuchets, a fucking pound in the pump well, out of them. I guess that's a good thing. On the walls. Okay, let's go <laughs> this way. Voltus said if you don't order, he'll rip your balls off and make a witch's medallion. Eh? Well, that would be interesting. <laughs> okay, before we go upstairs, because here up Have is no the mercy. king, let's see if we can do some crafting of a potion. Um, So, these are the potions. And, oh, I'm getting a little lag. These are the amount of materials we have. We can have more of one. Uh, but at least the thing we do is they all have the good or the material we need. Like this is the vitriol, which is the working compound of that stuff. So apparently in Bessel there's vitriol. And this one is the regeneration potion. Apparently we can't make it yet because we're missing two ingredients. Um, let me just gather some stuff and I will be right back. Okay, and I found the amount of potions we need. 
Uh, we can make two of these. Let's just make one for now. And let's see, can we make other stuff? This one is a bomb, which we can make one of. Or we create can create a different kinds of potions. This one increases melee damage. Let's create a few of those. Let's do two of those. We've got enough ingredients for that. We got Rook. Oh, we already made Rook. Um, which one is this one? Increase the sign intensity. Mm. No, not now. This one is in the resistance to a lot, but can we do that if we want to do that? No. We got cat, which is when you are able to see in the dark. I like this one. We will need this one actually uh, later in the game, so I will make it already. And this one is an oil which increases bleeding. Um, let's make one of those. Okay. And with that, we can go. The men here are doing some stretching. Some good morning stretching. And here they are training a little for the big battle. Oh, more mushrooms. Well, good luck all. Um, we are going to battle. Blah, blah, blah. Will are going. Will be going. Relax, relax. I'm already there. A beautiful day for battle. Fear not, Excellency. We're out of range of their arbalists. I am no warrior, sir. I must admit, I prefer to joust verbally. <laughs> well, sometimes that was needed. Finally. Traitors of the realm boil tar on the walls while you dally with the royal advisor. How may I assist you, sire? We mount an assault today, oh, wow. and you'll be at my it? side. Follow me, gentlemen. Let's not keep the traitors waiting. Oh, that's a close call. That was ballista bolts. Sire, you said we were out of range. That was a ballista, Excellency. Its arms strengthened with bronze plates and strung with horsehair. It can propel heavy bolts up to a mile away. A deadly and very costly weapon. An experienced <laughs> crew can cock and release two bolts each minute. Yet it has one flaw. Your Grace, please take cover. The recoil of the arms is so strong upon firing that the weapon shifts. It simply cannot hit the same spot twice. I had no idea your grace was a learned military engineer. I'm not. I gave the Baroness those ballistae <laughs> two years ago for her birthday. Oh, that's uh, too bad. Sire. What say you, Excellency, of men who live in spite of such wounds? And what say you, your grace, of soldiers who inflict them? Those who did this live no more. Wow, what happened to me? Master Geralt, I wish to converse with you once the storm of battle has subsided. Forgive me, Excellency. I plan to leave the royal court as soon as possible. Who might I know why? Too often they take me for someone I love. What do they call you, soldier? Wait. You served with me at Brenneran during our foray into the Pontar Valley. Norman Sador. Still an arbalist? Yes, sir. Fight has not been kind to me. Ha! <laughs> Norman Sador, for your years of faithful service to the crown, I appoint you to of the are or Onwards, the squads no of crossbows they had, or I thought it was ballista crew, but I guess it is uh, a crew of crossbows. Forgive my candor, your majesty, but uh, I must ask, what fate awaits the royal bastards when they're my children? If I hear bastard one more time, someone will die painfully. Your grace, for me. But the laws of succession are irrefutably clear. Piss on the laws. I'll change them if need be. Above all, I'll not allow a band of treacherous barons to use my children as their banner. Your Majesty is entirely within his rights. Adder is dead, and I have no other <laughs> That's children. the real reason why we're I doing see. this. This conversation is over, Excellency. It almost, like a, almost sounds like a fight on Game of Thrones, actually. 
black ones in my camp before a battle. What has the world come to? Nothing would make me happier than returning his shriveled head to Emir in a sack. But Triss Merigold insisted I be patient and courteous. Well, was I? not quite. Not really. I actually saw His Excellency sweat. <laughs> but that'll be our secret. <laughs> you brought your sense of humor along. Have you learned anything? Uh, we're not going to tell him who wish her. Nothing new, sire. A month's passed and we don't know any more than we knew when we began. This investigation's going nowhere. My agents have learned little also. But we'll find the culprits. It's just a question of time. Now for the battle. I want you at my side today. Then you may go where you please. Well, at Thank least you, he is being taken. His... Where are you aiming? Oh, damn. In the my voice. Soldier. It is. Oh, never mind. Hey, we know him. What is going on up there? The gods count at your valley. Catch, Witcher. Aim for the road with the red plume. Not six months ago, <laughs> he swore eternal friendship to me. Quickly! Okay, higher. let's see if I can hit it this time. Next time, uh, last time I tried this, I missed, and it's him. And I aim for his head, but let's now aim a little lower. Three degrees. Hit, hit, hit! Please hit, please hit! Oh! We hit the bastard. He ducked. Damn it. We'll get him on the walls. Follow me, Witcher. Uh, it hit on this exact same place. I think that was a scripted miss. But oh well, we tried. We tried. And we're in the siege tower. Now it's time to get up. Well, apparently there is some kind of slavery going on. Where are these elves? They look so skinny, they look like elves. You know, Witcher, I'm prepared to forgive Louisa. All she need do is to kneel before her king. Very noble of you. Are you mocking me? Never mind. I'm certain Louisa will realize her mistakes. Besides, children should have a mother. Lost. It's quite simple. Louisa and I had a bit of a skip. She made demands I could not fulfill. Yeah, Understand? I, do. I think so. <clears throat> Count Echeverry and others immediately intervened, all noble, all sympathetic. They claimed the evil king would take her children, but they would protect them, even Let's place not. them on the throne. And the Baroness was duped, a motherly love used. In truth, they desire privileges that would weaken the throne. Going in country there, your wife. And a long road at your toe. Weird battle songs. Oh, two more ballistas. Red and vodka's all you'll get. And that's one ballista less. Okay. Oh, good to know that happens. To battle. Where the hell are we headed? To battle! Victory. What the fuck do we want? So standard. Victory! This I like! Eyes on the bridge! We're nearly there! And with that, I think this has to be the end of this first episode. I hope to see you all next time. Bye bye.